Night Denver, you've been awesome. Please give it up for Nita Mosby Tyler. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So my mother couldn't name me Kimberly or Betsy or Susie. She had to name me something with soul. It was Dwinita, D-W-I-N-I-T-A, a name that you couldn't pronounce or spell, and some said was too ethnic, so I am Nita. So this is where I was born, Georgia, Southern Belle, Georgia Peach, and I miss Atlanta, 1978. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So um, this, this next photo that pops up is Georgia Stone Mountain. This is what I thought a mountain was. It's just a big hunk of granite, but I didn't know any better in the middle of Atlanta. We had a great time having picnics at the bottom of the mountain while the clan met on the top, but who knew? Here's my favorite picture. I'm the black girl. That's me. And that's uh, Miss Ann, my ballet teacher. Miss Ann taught ballet in the black community because we were not allowed to take ballet with little white girls. I learned a lot about equity from Miss Ann. This is a very complicated picture for me because it reminds me of my past when I drank from the colored water fountain. When I was young, I wasn't sure why I drank from the colored water fountain, but it was there that I learned that there was something very different about me. I've been thinking a lot. I've been thinking a lot lately about water fountains and what the artifacts of the past are in 2017 and what the colored water fountain is and what the white water fountain is too. Yep, I'm from the South, so I like pie, but I don't like this kind of pie. I don't like the fact that the smallest slice of the pie has to be shared by the greatest number of people. Those inequities piss me off. So what water fountain are we drinking from when people don't have access, when people can't get to the top, when people can't even get in? What kind of water fountain are we drinking from when we have the audacity to judge who gets to love whom and how? What kind of water fountain are we drinking from then? What kind of water fountain are we drinking from when we feel like it's hate when we see people with head coverings and are mad about who they worship with and to and for, what water fountain are we drinking from? What water fountain are we drinking from when we have the audacity to think that immigrants don't belong here and refugees don't belong here and we can't remember where the backbone of this country came from? What water fountain are we drinking from? And what water fountain are we drinking from when we forget our elders, whose shoulders we stand upon, where our sense came from, where our knowledge comes from, what water fountain are we drinking from? And what water fountain are we drinking from when we badmouth millennials and we talk about their capabilities and we say ha 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 as if they didn't carry the torch for who and what will be in the future? So here we are, I'm a Coloradan girl now, I'm still Miss Atlanta, but I can tell you this, I've learned a lot about water fountains in the state of Colorado. One thing that I can tell you about my journey in Colorado is I now know what a real mountain is. <laughs> It's not a hunk of granite, and I'm not really worried about the Klan being on top for their staff meetings. It's really a beautiful thing, this Colorado. I also am showing up in some interesting ways. I think I've become the Miss Ann that I told you about a few slides back. I'm showing up in communities that aren't used to seeing people just like me and hoping to teach about equity and lift people up in ways that I was. You see, my water fountain has changed. I'm still drinking from one. There's still some problems with the water fountain, but it's got a new label on it, which is really sort of complicated, goofy, creepy, and strange. So I have some homework for you. I want you to think about this when you go back to your communities, your schools, your home. Look at your neighborhood. Take a look at the water fountains that are present in your neighborhood. What are they? What are they representing? And know this about water fountains. The signs are removable. The signs are interchangeable. And it's up to you to decide what the signs say, represent, or not. 
Thank you.